Hey dolls and friends, welcome back and thanks so much for spending part of your day with me. If you're new here, my name is Amber Michonne and I create high-end home decor crafts, sprinkle in a little bit of hauls and reviews. But if you're not new, hey doll, hey. So today's video, I'm super excited to share this huge haul and review items with you all. A big thank you to Timu for sponsoring today's video. Timu is an online marketplace where you can find anything your heart desires. I'm so serious. They have some really good deals and they have a range of products that they sell. So anything from household items to organizational items to storage to clothing, fashion, accessories, and even appliances. So once you're watching this video, I want you to go ahead to my description box or just look at the screen. I will have a couple of discount codes for you to get up to 40% off of your next purchase at Timu. So you can either download their app or you can just go to timu.com on your browser on any device that you're using. So when they reached out to me and asked if I wanted to try out their website and review some of their items, I could not pass it up. I think you guys are gonna really like this video and really, I really want you to go to Timu's website and app to see what you can purchase for yourself today. So the first thing I'm gonna start off with is this intelligent light. And what I love about it is my absolute favorite thing. It is a light that goes underneath like your cabinets or you can put it on a wall or you can put it like next to your vanity set but it has so many different settings and look how bright that is my favorite part about this is that the back side it comes with two of these like magnetized tags so they're magnetized to the light fixture piece and then all you're gonna do is peel off well, that one fell all you're gonna do is peel off this backing part right here and this is adhesive and it's gonna stick to whatever surface that you put it on I use these in my kitchen and they are a godsend. I don't know about you, but sometimes my light underneath my my microwave, like above my oven, is not bright at all. So I use this underneath that and it changed the game for that. I got four of these lights and the other three I put underneath my cabinets just to brighten up my space and my kitchen a whole lot more. But like I said, you can put them in your bathroom or a vanity area that is like away from, like not part of your bathroom. I think it would be really, really nice. And to charge these, they actually come with a USB cord where you just stick this in and you plug this in and to your wall if you have one of the you know the little outlet butts or you can plug it into your computer to charge it as well so I absolutely love this I love moving away from like actual double-a triple-a battery powdered items <laughs> I am loving that because we all have these kind of cords so yeah one thing I will say about this is that they are only magnetized to certain parts of this light. So it's really in this vicinity closer to the edge of the light. When you get in the middle, it doesn't really stick at all. So just be mindful of that when you do purchase them. But I recommend this 10 out of 10. So for my next household items, I'm going to stay in the kitchen area. And I got a couple of these soap like holders. So um, this actually unfortunately does not fit around like my sink head. It just doesn't fit around it to be able to attach to the back side. But I mean, you can still put this on the inside of your sink. I think I'm going to put it on my divider and try to figure out a way to get it to clamp down just a bit so I can put my soap and anything else like some sponges. I have my bottle brush cleaners for my baby's bottles and put that in here. But I thought this was a pretty genius way to hold all your stuff. And then it has the holes at the bottom so that way it doesn't smell so the water just kind of drips through and it's easy to clean super easy to clean i also got a few other kitchen essentials for cleaning so i got this sprillo pad and sponge holder and it is super easy to use i love that it has a handle on top of it and it really cleans the top of my stove very well if you have an electric stove top like me this pad works wonders it's rough enough but soft enough to not scratch the surface and it's just super easy to um, work with and it holds um, soap really really well. I also got this measuring key because I never know how much cups or how much teaspoons is in a cup or whatever. I don't know that at all so this helps when I'm attempting to do some baking in the house so I have my measurements right. 
and it's magnetic so it just sticks to the refrigerator and I have it on the side of mine. And my last kitchen piece is probably going to be my second favorite behind my under cabinet lights that I'm using in my kitchen and it is this like strainer colander whatever you call it. I think like on the west coast and the midwest or east coast it's like it has three different names but what I love about it is that it is expandable oh my goodness this is so cool I really really like this it can hang on your sink or you can just close it up and put it in your sink I find it very helpful when I rinse out both my fruits and vegetables after we do a day of shopping or really a weekend of shopping but you can also put your you know meats in here fish uh, chicken just to rinse out and have it over the cat over the sink so that way your mess area is contained to one small space now I'm going to move on to some other household but more storage and organizational items I absolutely love these now I don't know about you but I always get Get all of my jewelry earrings bracelet necklaces and some rings all mixed up together and all kind of tangled together well on Timu's site I have found the perfect solution I found two different things that will hold my jewelry the first one is going to be these small containers they come in a pack of 10 and they will hold some small bracelets some necklaces and some smaller earrings I absolutely love them especially if you have like a lot of studs I actually don't really have a lot of studs as I was separating and organizing my jewelry I, I realized that I actually have like a lot of hoops and a lot of dangly earrings so my second piece is going to be this two door and it is collapsible like jewelry holder where I put all of my necklaces my bracelets and all of the earrings that all my hanging earrings that I have and it is the perfect solution if you are looking for something small and compact something that you can even travel with um I do have a larger like jewelry case that my husband bought me years ago and it has legs it stands on its own but it's super bulky and super big and I find that what I found on Timu's site is actually is much helpful to keep my clutter down. Keeping in line with organization for your personal items, I found this purse hanger holder and it has three compartments on both sides. I really actually love this item because I have tons of purses and I actually have a lot of small like purses that you just like put like on your forearm not really like a lot of shoulder straps and if I do have shoulder straps they're really small compact purses so you can I can even put like two of my shoulder over the shoulder like crossbody purses in these compartments and fit probably like 12 purses in here I really like this product I think it is super versatile and I love how functional and user-friendly it is you just pop it right there in your closet with all your clothes Next up, we're going to go to the fashion side of things, and I love me a nice article of clothing, boo. I'm just saying. And these glasses I also got from Tivu. They are not prescription. They are not sunglasses, but they are just kind of fashion, fun glasses that you can wear. I actually am a blind as a bat, so I have wear contacts 24-7, but when I do have my glasses on, I kind of go for the larger frames, and I absolutely love these, and I love the pink tint that they have to them. I think they are so cute, so adorable. And I got a couple other sunglasses from Timu as well. They have a variety of choice in sunglasses that you can choose from and I think you are going to like it. But also you guys, they have some really nice clothes and their clothing go all the way down from extra small, I think actually extra extra small, all the way to like 3X. So I'm going to show you, give you a little fashion show for some of the items that I have found. And I find that they are super comfortable. I love the material on them. They're super soft and they are true to size. Now, I got extra large in most if not all of my article of clothing because I like my stuff to feel a little loose fitting I don't like anything too tight on me because you know as women we're always self-conscious about our bodies but I just wanted stuff that was really flattering and not too tight but a little bit loose on me so that I would be comfortable throughout the day I am a full-time a working a mom that has a baby at home so I just need stuff that's really fluid really easy to move around in sit down all day in get up and get down don't mind that the baby kind of spits up on me with and is easy to clean and all of these clothes I'm telling you guys I absolutely love I tend to always only buy shirts too I don't have a lot of pants I wear a lot of leggings but I decided to go ahead and try some of like their jogging pants that they have with like this set right here it's so comfortable I've been wearing it all day I'm going to pick up my kids going to the store and everything like that and I think that 
it's just amazing and the price cannot be beat. For all my gardening people out there, Timu has a variety of different products that you can purchase off of their site. For my husband, I do not have the green thumb whatsoever. It is my husband. So I got him actually these bags where you can put and grow vegetables in here. Now my husband says these are mainly for potatoes and onions. So I think I got the wrong one, but he said he's still going to use it. Now it's not the time for him to do it right now, but I cannot wait to share this with you guys when he actually does this. I thought he would be able to grow his like herbs and like his vegetables and some fruit that he has. He may be able to put fruit in here, but I'm gonna leave that up to him. I'm not even gonna pretend like I know what I'm doing when it comes to gardening. So yeah, we'll share that at a later date. <laughs> now I say the best for last and the best meaning the crafting supplies or the items that you can use for crafting on Timu's site. I absolutely love everything that I got and I cannot wait to share how I create with them but the first thing I'm going to share are these wood like uh, frames so they come in a set of four so you can make a sign out of these four three different colors I just got the white one and this I think this is called teak wood color they have a darker wood color but what I love about them is that one of the sides already has a hanger on here for you you can either choose to use it or take it off the other thing that is a little confusing is that they have these magnets right here on both sides like either end of each of the wood pieces now Unless you're hanging that on a refrigerator or something, I'm not really sure why it's there, but I guess they want it to be multi-purpose for you. But I plan on making a couple of signs with these. I think the best way to utilize these is just to use two maybe um, at one for one sign. And if you have extra canvases from canvas like frames or canvas pictures, you know what I'm saying from any of your cra local craft stores and I think that would be a really great option to use. Any kind of cloth you can just hot glue it on there but I can't wait to share this with you guys. I really am excited about this find right here. The next thing I found is really adorable coffee decal. So it's just a sticker and all you're going to do is slap it on a sign and use some Mod Podge. Super simple and easy but I can't wait to show you like I said. The other thing I found is it's really large. It's way larger than I thought it was going to be. And it's for your bathroom. It says if, what does it say? If you run out of toilet paper, text me because I know you're on your phone. <laughs> Super cute. Next, I actually got a trio of like canvas. If These feel like canvas um, material. So it's about it's all butterflies and I apps I think they're striking. It's so beautiful. Look at how pretty this one is right here. And then this is the second one. And then this is the third one. Now I think it goes up like this, yeah. But I think these are just so so gorgeous. I absolutely love these. Um Blue is one of my favorite colors behind purple, but I thought this would look really pretty in a bathroom. I have a guest bathroom um, upstairs that has the colors blue and yellow. So I'm thinking about framing these up. You can, I can even frame them up with these that I bought and um, put them up on the wall. I think it's adorable. I think it's a great idea and super easy because this was super inexpensive. And so quick, easy, inexpensive decor is always my jam. <laughs> the last canvas material that I'm going to make out of a sign is going to be this cute farmhouse like print. It's so adorable. I never thought that I would be that farmhouse girl that would actually love the cow, pig, and the chicken. I mean, I know that is quintessential like cliche farmhouse decor, but I never thought of myself as like an animal farmhouse lover, but I am loving it the older I get as the years pass. Just give me all the cows, pigs, and chickens. But I really like this. Um, I think that you could possibly use these, but I think these are just a little bit too large unless you just do um, one on the top and then one on the bottom like that. But I have a totally different idea and way to go with this, but I thought it was super adorable. Like I said, quick inexpensive decor is my jam now if you've been around for a while you know that i absolutely love making floral wreaths i love florals period you just see 
my little floral hanger on my closet door. It is packed with florals. It never gets empty because I'm always restocking it with some florals that I find. So on Timu's site, I had to go and find some of their florals. And I saw some really gorgeous florals that I had to choose. Now I got a variety of different colors and styles that match my decor uh, year round and season to season. I got a lot of eucalyptus bushes. They are super pretty and really high end looking. They look so good. I know they're plastic, but they don't look plastic and you can just pair it in a pitcher or a vase and you are good to go. I also got some hydrangea rose bush combinations in a couple different colors, some purples, light pinks, reds, oranges, you name it and of course some whites. I think they're really really gorgeous, super inexpensive. They're small, I'm gonna be honest, they are small bouquets and they have a weird smell to them I think because they're packaged and it just has this really strong like plastic like packaging smell so you just gotta have to air out whatever room that you're in to get the smell out light a candle spray it down with some body spray or you know some air freshener mist. so i will be honest on that they are smaller bouquets than what i was actually expecting but they're really inexpensive and they're really beautiful so i'm really not mad about it just had to air out my room <laughs> All right, dolls, that's all I have for you today. I really hope you did enjoy this video. And if you did, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Let me know in the comments down below if you are familiar with Timu, if you are running to their site right now, as I will do once I'm done recording this video. Or, you know, just let me know your thoughts about some of the items that I was able to share with you today. Again, I want to say a big thank you to Timu for sponsoring today's video. And make sure you guys head down to my description box. Get those links so you can get your percentage off of your next order. All right, dolls, be blessed, stay safe, and I will see y'all on the next one. Bye.